Some people have to say how they want you to take the next ten steps of your day. Some people want to tell you what they want you to do. But I'm gonna live my life. Why don't you just live yours? Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm gonna tell you, push through, push through. See you guys. All right, so I just bought this tablecloth it says from Dollar Tree, and it says round. Okay. Man. Well, anyways, I want to show y'all what we got. What I picked up at Goodwill and oh. Dollar Tree. I got this picture frame here. Oh yeah, we got the grill. There. Oh, good grandma. I have a, we have a question. And it's ninety nine cents. And I also picked this one up at Goodwill. And it was 99 cents as well. And I found this one right here. Okay. So I'm so excited because it was 3 dollars So I already got, I got this at Dollar Tree as well. But I think that's it for right now, y'all. I'll show you my Dollar Tree stuff in a minute. We, we just got back home. y'all so let me show y'all what i picked up at dollar tree well little mama picked this up right here she wanted some mozzarella sticks so we can get that cleaned up and put it in the freezer for her and i also picked up some rotel dip i mean um salsa portion of it because I, I have some cheese already and i needed some my mom needed some so i bought four cans and then little mama also picked up a lobster egg roll splatter screens for when I'm cooking bacon or anything of that nature that likes to splatter. So I got that. Picked up another one of these hand mittens here because I already have one. And when I originally got these, only they only had one in my location at the time. So I got, well, another one now. Noah picked up some Christmas candy. And then I picked up two, no you're not, to get some food. I picked up two of these bins here, y'all. Right here for when I do my pantry video. Y'all will see soon. I'm excited because I'm doing it on a budget for my Poshmark um, stuff to hold my thank you cards and my tape and some other stuff. And I also picked up these. Y'all, I'm so excited because I was looking for these for my tea. I'm going to use this for my tea. Two of these. Also picked up one of these, a Goo Gone, just to have in our junk drawer type space so we can have some just to take care of whatever may pop up on the walls or whatever. Picked up some disposable masks here when I do my, um, a few other projects that are coming up soon. I'll have that. And little man picked these up because we needed some more. And I picked up two of these black baskets here. These are the wider ones. Like maybe I'll probably use them for, I don't know. Wait till you see the video and you'll know what I used them for. But they will get used in the house, so. And that's everything that I picked up at Dollar Tree. Um, oh, I also picked these two things up. This is for me to have for DIY projects. And this is actually for little mama because she has a school project that she has to do and it has to look old, you know, type of thing. So I thought it was good paper for that, contemplating for that.
But you right, saying... I, I pulled this right here off of uh -huh. the uh, cap and I uh, uh, put the uh, the uh, proper piece on for the dishwasher. Okay. I just gotta get a clamp for it to clamp it down. Okay. So it won't come out, okay? Gotcha. Cool beans. Right. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, thank you. It's been a headache. <laughs> All right, y'all, so he has a mask on, thinking, but look at this, all this is leaking here. It's been leaking more and more in here, y'all. This is just crazy, but he's gonna fix it and say we're gonna get the good to go, so I'm thankful for that. Thank you, Lord. All right, he was supposed to be here tomorrow, y'all. They done sent him out today, so hubby's not here. They had hubby's number, number was wrong. They had like the first three and they put a one in front of it, which is not even gonna work, because there's not even a real number here. Uh, it was crazy. Anyways, he's gonna do that taken care of. I'm appreciative, and I'm glad the Lord he had his mask on, because I wasn't expecting that at all. 10.35, so he's out there now. And that's why I knew I was smelling something, y'all. It's like, why I keep smelling something that smells Oh, Let me get a rag. Uh, but, yeah, look at that. Just leaking. So, anywho. Oh, go ahead. You good? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. This right here, he's going to build a hole. Look at that water all in there. More water spilled out. Look how that's looking inside. Like, it's just... Look at that, y'all. Look at all this. So he's going to have to build a whole new pipe system because it, it, all he did was touch it, y'all, and it fell down. And he said, water just sitting in there. That's it. And this is what they had on there. Craziness. We actually put this down. It smells bad. Like, it's just sitting. Woo, y'all, it's a mess. So I just came back in here to spray in Clorox to try to get kill some of the germs that's in here as far as smell and stuff. But it, it's bad, y'all. And I kept smelling it yesterday and the day before. I was like, what is that smell? And I couldn't figure it out. So I was wiping the counters down and just everything. I'm, I'm a freak like that. Like, I be a clean freak in that aspect, okay? So, anyways, sitting here, as you can see, it's more and more. I had to bring a towel. This was just on the floor. When uh, the white piece with the black right here was just on the ground, water just coming all out um, inside of here. So all this has been molding out, as you can see, and everything. Like, so they got to come and redo all this. But he said he got to build a whole new pipe system, y'all. So he done drained all the water that was just sitting in there. The water just sitting. So whenever we letting water out or washing or whatever, it's just sitting in the pipes. It's not going anywhere, which is ridiculous. So he's like, yeah, I don't like when they do these type of piping and stuff, which is more of a fast thing and they're not doing it correctly. It's just fixed. It's just the same thing that the dishwasher guy said. So uh, so anyway, he's going to Home Depot now to try and get that, uh, go get the pipes and stuff so he can rebuild this. Because at first he thought it was just this part here where it would just be, you know, he could take that piece and everything would be good. Uh-uh. He got in here, he started wiggling. Like he, he didn't even wiggle wiggle, y'all. He just touched it and it just slid out. So that could have been real more disastrous than what it is. But I'm taking pictures too at the same time while I tell y'all and just have this documentation. Because it's like they don't have no problem with taking our rental, our, our money. But they ain't trying to fix stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what made no sense to me. So this is his bucket. I got water. I'm glad I got these little things here. I can just throw it in the washing machine. So, that, that, that. And, um... Uh, okay. Yeah, to cut the whole pipes and stuff out. So this will be, uh... A lot, but you know, a lot to do it right. As a I hear you. I hear you. I want it done right. Do it and do it wrong. And look, and you see what happened when it's done wrong, right? Okay. I mean, it's still a lot. That, that ain't cheap, right there. I can imagine. But it's quick. Right. But it's wrong. Right. Right. <laughs> it don't benefit nobody, so you know. You know. <laughs> but they pay check. That's all they want. That's, That's all they want. want. Ay, ay, ay. I'm not gonna complain. You know, New Year, new things. <laughs> right, right, right. right. Look at that. Positive matter. Right. There you go. There you go. So. Okay. This is going to be, um, this is going to drain over to here, okay. down and over, which is going to have a big old way down here loop to go out. Right, so right, right. That's about a normal uh, drop on that, so that will definitely flow great. So okay. We're going to be good to go. Okay. And so the dishwasher should be straight to... Yes, what's gonna hook, this is the uh, thing for the dishwasher here. Okay, so okay, gotcha. So this is the new you. one here for hooking up to there. And the dishwasher has to, it's supposed to, it has to have a, uh, in order for it to keep from... Looking at here constantly, it right. has to have a loop in it, so that one will work how they had it. So, okay, uh, gotcha. But, uh, and that's what the other guy said. He was like, look, uh-uh, the, the plumbing's got to get right. This is fine. It's just they got to hook it up to that because they didn't do it. So I said, okay, cool. Okay. Well, <laughs> what he would have done was just took this cap off of here, this cap off, mm -hmm. and put this on here, and that would have been fine. But, even, but what that, that dishwasher kicks out pretty strong. Right. 
it would end up flooding this whole entire floor because it's gonna, it was gonna definitely pull this pipe down. Right, especially I know just by watching you, you just mm-hmm. it just fell right off. So it's like goodness. Right, exactly. Ay, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, All right. So, I'm gonna get you straight now. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate it so much. <laughs> All right, guys, he's heating up. Down there, I pray that everything is good for the dishwasher and all of that. We shall see. All right, y'all. He just left. He got everything done. Oh, let me spray real quick. I don't know he had a mask on. Still wanna spray stuff down. There we go. Nope. I just walked in there. Ooh, I'm gonna let that settle for a minute, y'all. <laughs> so I'm about to wash my rugs. But he did say that we could, um, that he, he checked the sinks and everything to make sure water's flowing good and the pipes and everything. But all the other water damage and stuff, that was there prior when we first got here. So, anywho, but he did all of that there. I'm going to wash these towels and stuff and put this in the wash machine to wash all of that. <clears throat> and I'm about to load up my dishwasher real quick. I got a few dishes. I might just put all these dishes in there just to wash them again. <laughs> all right. Hey, y'all. Happy Friday. It is January 7th, I think it is. Um, we decided to come over here to the park so the crew can get some energy out. <clears throat> They've been wanting to come to this park anyway for a minute, so we did that. And it's going to help me get my steps in for today for the whole program that I'm doing, which I'll do a dedicated video once I get everything, you know, squared away and all that. But anyways, hope y'all are doing well. Got vlogs dropping, y'all. Y'all know they're dropping, they're dropping. I feel like my lips are dry, but there's lighting, though, y'all cute cute picture <laughs> i gotta take pictures y'all all right so we get on the sidewalk uh we came out here years ago y'all didn't realize this was the same park for like fourth july i think in 2018 19 might even have that footage still too so i possibly share that uh, let me know if y'all want to see rewind well i call them rewind vlogs but that's not actually what you know i made that up for vlogs that happened before my youtube channel because i was doing vlogging for a minute y'all i just didn't um you know have a channel to put it on <laughs> So, um, sorry about the sun, about to be in your eyes. I'm out here letting them get some time in over here. Look at this child of mine. <laughs> cool beans. It's nice. He got that for Christmas, by the way. Then we're going to head to Awesome Job, son. <laughs> um, and then I'm about to go to Dollar General to pick up some water. And then get on back to the house, y'all. We've been out ripping and running today, okay? Ripping and running. Sorry for all the movement, y'all. I don't have no tripod or anything. And I'm using my phone. So this is my Samsung S21 Plus that I'm recording on right now. So hopefully the quality should be good. We'll see. But just wanted to talk, chit chat with y'all for a little bit, say hey and things. But yeah, I'm not gonna be sharing too much, y'all. Not a whole lot of stuff. Like I, I feel like I overshare <laughs> a little bit. I think there's some things I just need to pull back on. But it's not like that's something brand new for me. I've been doing that for a long time and I'm gonna go back in my little shell. But I mean, I feel like what I share is decent, you know? Like I don't want it to seem like I'm just, oh, she putting everything out there. Oh, she doing this. But I mean, every day ain't a good day. I think I mentioned that in my last vlog. Every day ain't a good day. Every day is not a happy day. Every day is not sunshine and rainbows, okay? So I will share that. If I'm feeling down, then I'll do it, you know? I want my channel to be positive and uplifting and 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 to be encouraging for other mamas, women's, women's, other women and mamas and just people in general, okay? Because I'm my own light. I got something to share, you know? We on this earth for a reason, right? I don't know if it's YouTube for me or if it's me just being a mama or me being a wife or is it just me being Kenyatta in general, you know? But there's a reason... God kept me here in, in, in my humble beginnings of me coming into this world. So other than that, I just want to do things to help y'all. And will I do it correctly? No. Will I know the right terminology? No. But y'all, this is me. This is Kenyatta. This is who I am. And if y'all know me on a more personal level, and I mean, even deeper than some of my YouTube friends and stuff, like, you know me, grew up with me type of thing, y'all know that's just me naturally. Okay. And that's all I can be. Like 2022 for me this year is going to be a whole lot of unapologetic being the true Kenyatta. I'm not gonna be uh trying to feel like I gotta be like the Tamikas and Marthas and things like that here on these YouTube streets you know what I'm saying like I'm so over with trying to uh feel like I have to be like them on YouTube or be like them on Instagram and things of that nature I'm not gonna do that I'm gonna be Kenyatta and if I get 
likes, I get likes. If I don't, I don't. But that's for me. Like, my YouTube channel is for my family to come back and look back on and, and have this documented. That's the main thing. I started my whole why for this, y'all, was family. My husband was over the road. He wasn't able to be home. And I did it because of me. I love to watch old videos of me and the kids or just family in general. So that's why I did my YouTube. I was like, huh, I could share it with them and then make friends at the same time. You know what I have with some people. Um, others, not so much. But yeah, there's some few story times I could tell y'all about. <laughs> There's a few story time. Let me know if y'all want to hear some story times because me and hubby got some we can share. Also, I want to do a marriage Q&A. So if y'all have some questions, let me know down below or send them to me on Instagram. I'm working back on getting on there. I'm trying to tweak some things because I want to be more of a brand for my family and myself. You know, um, K Renee is not just me. K Renee is me and them. You know, like I always said, what channel? K Renee and them channel, uh, which we. <laughs> So yeah, but also I'm gonna start working out and doing things more for me. So you know, y'all let me know. Just wanna see that they over here playing. Hi, hi. Okay, go crazy. Anyways, so that's what I'm just wanting to know. Let me know what y'all want to do. Like, would y'all want to work out together? Uh, would y'all want to do? Because I'm thinking of doing a whole separate channel just for, you know, moms and works out, moms who work out or whatever. I don't know, y'all. I'm trying to figure it out, but I know that's what I want to do because I have to get myself right. I'm about to be 40 here soon, so. Hey, y'all. I'm cold. <laughs> yeah. My teeth are freezing. I bet, but you want to come to the park and if it's having a fussy fit and stuff. Yes, you were. Uh, but anyways, so we out here. Uh, and, yeah, I'm going to keep walking. <laughs> I just like the sun. I had to come in. So, y'all, it's, it's melanin in, in here, okay? <laughs> so, yeah, let me know how y'all feel. What's y'all going through? If y'all going through something, I mean, we all going through something, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody perfect and not going through nothing in their life. And if you are, I don't know what to tell you. I don't want to congratulate you because it's like, mm, you living up a fake life, I guess. If <laughs> you got your life going perfect 24-7, okay? All right, so babe obviously knows somebody here. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, but okay. On YouTube and stuff. That That's Junior, man. <laughs> Junior Honduras. I see you, dude. I'm still in the video, babe. <laughs> now, he don't know that I done saw him. <laughs> and you got a trainee with you. I see that. You know, so, but, you know, hi. <laughs> I'm at the tag and everything. Yeah, it's January the 8th, I think it is. I think it is. At 10.30 a.m. in Fulton Industrial Boulevard. Fulton Industrial Boulevard. Come on with it. And yeah, we just passed him. I even honked and back there, there, and he honked. Didn't. Yes, we were the little blue van. He didn't respond. No, because he if I don't know what's what. Or she didn't respond. Probably scared the mess out of her. Now I feel sad. Oh. She didn't waver or anything. She's like training. That. You don't see that honk your horn. She probably thinking what's wrong? Did I get over She's the line? She's learned how to be a safe driver. She she needs to keep her eyes open for anything and everything. <laughs> there he is. There they are. Oh well. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, y'all. This man that sat here and had a whole conniption and things trying I to sit here. Oh my gosh. Y'all thinking something. What? I said, like, what? What's the matter? I said, that's, that's Junior. Junior. I'm like, who is Junior? <laughs> <laughs> so, y'all like his stuff. Look at him. Find him on YouTube. Tell him K Renee and Connor Cross Blue sent y'all over there. I don't know. Yep. So, hopefully, we can go past again. And you better not hunt no more. We're about to turn. Okay, bye. bye. All right, gotta go. Ooh, yeah. Look at, look at. It is coming down, coming down, coming down. Nope, not today. <laughs> Mom, that's really mad. I know. You went up? Oh, I just filmed a little bit. No, went up. No, but your cornbread is there. So, little mom just got done taking making cornbread. Yeah, you almost burned. Look at it, child. So, we are here at the house chilling. Um, so, we're not doing anything. The kids actually go back to school tomorrow morning. Just been in chill mode pretty much all morning, all day. Chill mode, just resting. I gotta do her hair, finish that up. She's supposed to leave it how I did it, but she ended up changing it up a little bit. The boys are over here playing, two of them playing the game. And the teenager is 
over there playing this game. And yes, yeah, so I gotta redo it. I'm just gonna be retwisting it back up the way I had it. She wasn't supposed to take it down, sorry, but to she took it down and yeah. So anyway, I'm gonna do that in a little bit. It should take too long since I got everything pretty much parted and stuff and re-grease it and all that type of stuff. It's been, it's still clean, so we're good. Be careful, mama, it's hot. It just came out. So this is her plate she wanted to show y'all. Yummy. And I got a little Starbucks. And we had though. Starbucks water there yesterday. And no, the other, other the other day. day. And she used that as a little juice cup. <laughs> Enjoy. You you me? What? Oh, I hope y'all are doing good. And yeah, we're just gonna continue to chill out. And anyways, happy Sunday. It is January the 9th. And like I said, tomorrow the crew go back to school, so. I'm about to get these clothes out and start the book. each other <laughs> <laughs> do a quick little walkthrough of the 12 month lined vertical layout 2022 January through December um, happy planner so my road tie sis actually got this for me shout out to her the real camo vlogs thank you girl got it for Christmas <clears throat> so um, spoonful spoonful of faith by Jenna Holiday is the one that actually created this. It's funny because I actually had this in my cart at Target, <laughs> <clears throat> but I just didn't get it yet. So thankful for that. All right, let me take this off, y'all. I know it has been a minute since your girl has done a planner video. However, I have a whole playlist for you all to check out how I do things, what I do, and things of that line. Um, so I will leave that up above right there. Okay, so it is currently raining outside, so, and the rest of my family is in the other part of the house, so this is my little spot that I'm going to show y'all what's what, okay? Let me see if I can prop y'all up one moment. Okay, guys, so this is the best angle I can get for right now, so, <clears throat> excuse me. So, I save, actually save these right here. Let's start off with that. So, I just snipped it down at the bottom, and you can use these okay because you can make your own sticker sheet here by just adding stickers and things of that nature uh, that you like if you don't have some that you haven't seen or whatever you can make your own or use it at the dashboard however but I save this right here because you can fit in anything in your planner okay and I also save this portion as well because you can make a bookmark and you can do, I mean, a number of things, y'all. So just be mindful of what you got. You can save it and reuse it, okay? <laughs> as well as this here, guys. This could be a bookmark right there that you can place. You can cover it up, whatever you want to cover it up with. Or turn it to be this way here and work your magic, okay? You got creativity in you. You just got to use it and find it, okay? <laughs> All right, so I'm going to take this one off, too. This shows as well yes you guessed it right Kenyatta is saving this as well <laughs> all right first of all let's talk about this cover you guys this thing screams so much girl power mom power all power I mean like it just screams a lot to me and it's very motivating and encouraging to see women of color on the cover and um 
the message it has behind. This artist is phenomenal, and I definitely will be looking up more of her work to see what all she has to offer. So amazing things happen when you're kind, and I love that because I am a kind person. I am. So, all right, we're going to first open it up. I love the floral. I used to not be a floral girl, okay? But I do. I love that. So let me cut this real quick. Oops, sorry, y'all. Nothing, y'all. Okay, take that off. So this is something that they put in all the planners. Welcome to the Hat Planner Virtual. Vertical with line layout. So this is my first time actually having the vertical one. Last, well, not last year. A couple years ago. <clears throat> 2019, I actually had, had the, which is not here, it's in my bag at my parents' house, but um, I had the um, dashboard, mom planner dashboard layout, okay, and it had a bunch of different things you can do in it, so like I said, I'll link all those videos in the description box, as well as in the eye in the sky for y'all check those out and see how I did my thing, all right, don't mind my teenager, she's playing the game. <laughs> All right, so first thing it says is, hello, this is Happy Planner Belongs To, Planner Happy Life in 2022. Um, I'm sure y'all have seen some of these, but for the ones who aren't really in the planner community, you might not have. So I'm going to skim through real quick. I'm not going to go through each um, month as far as like what's inside, but we'll skim through and look a little bit because I do want to get started with um, setting this up and things. I actually am going to Franken plan. And if you don't know what Franken plan is, it is when you combine different planners in one. Okay, so for instance, I'm working on my weight loss, so I'm gonna have that. I'm also working on budgeting with me and my hubby, so I'm gonna have that in here. I just is also this right here is my faith portion of it, and just every day whatever I like to do, you know, mom keeping up scheduling and things like that with my kids and all of that. So that's Franken planning, and it can get pretty thick, y'all. So I would definitely have to upgrade my rings here and things to make it bigger. But you'll you'll see all that. I'll be doing a video on that. So the first thing it has here for you is, <clears throat> excuse me, 2022, set your goals. And it just has a yearly layout here for you to see all the months in this year. And it actually goes into 2023. It goes into December of 2023. So that's pretty cool. Next, it has each month the vertical weekly plan for each month and has all the dates so this is all the january february march april may june so on and so on the rest of the years going to december of 2022 here it shows the first layout which is january 2022 it gives you a little dot grid and a graph and just to put some priority goals and important dates things like that so you can kind of doodle and kind of brainstorm with that portion if you want the first cover so cute it's january it says speak good things to yourself y'all you don't know how important that is. <laughs> and I definitely am working on that within myself. But this year is going to be my self-care year. Myself, uh, me growing up. And I'm not grown, but I mean moving up and not just being a mama type of thing. Okay, I hope that makes sense to you. But So here is your monthly layout. Some notes you can put over here, but you can easily decorate it. Y'all will see. Y'all will see. Y'all will see. I'm going to get all excited again. Y'all, this is my this was my love back in the day. And I kind of left it alone to venture into other things with YouTube. But I'm getting back into it. And if people watch it, they watch it. If they don't, they don't. It's for me it's not for y'all unless you request something then it'll be for y'all <laughs> so let me know if you want to see something all right okay so i love that i love this type of layout because i'm able to still decorate it and but not keep it a little minimalistic um but have like a little aesthetic thing going on with it so you know it's really cool it makes me happy and so this is something new for me and i'm excited but i'm a little nervous because it's like okay i'm gonna decorate this thing but i already got some ideas brewing right now as i'm talking to you all on this video of what i can do because i'm quite the creative one y'all i'm quite the creative one so obviously i won't be using these so i'll probably just turn these into like some memory pages and just put like pictures and things from you know maybe christmas from last year or, or a little bit of things and pictures and stuff throughout the year so you can easily transfer that and transform this into a memory page or whatever you want to do just notes or uh, a brain dump spot whatever because here we are we are in it is sunday the 9th of january so the same with this one however we can start out with this week but anyway this is what it looks like let me i'm getting a little bit ahead of myself y'all okay so this is what january looks like okay here's february it gives you the same layout and things look at the picture so pretty i probably put my word of the year here which i have not shared with y'all yet the same thing with february it has the monthly layout which is my birthday month whoop, whoop, whoop. i'll be 39 this year y'all it's crazy 39 okay <laughs> 40 is i'm knocking at 40's door uh just keep growing is your inspiration for march and i love that okay april 
is some lovely flowers to keep you going. April flowers brings May showers. So May is let's root for each other and watch each other grow. I love that. Look at the girls. They look so happy. I want some friends like that. <laughs> so you got that. And then we have just keep trying. Love, love, love that for June. This one says grow for July. Love it. Is you can do brave things. That is so funny that that says that. Y'all, oh my gosh. Okay, God. All right, Lord. I hear you. I hear you. I actually have a sign on my... Hold on, let me show y'all. So this is what I actually have on my wall, y'all. It says you can do hard things. And I put it there so that I can see it every time I'm at my little desk space. And I also have my mom inspiration picture here for when I'm feeling like, woo, Lord, child. But yeah, I haven't decorated my desk space, my little workspace yet. So, you know, we'll work on that. But let's get back to this planner. All right, so I love what August says, y'all. Next month we have is September. Super cute. I love how simple it is. The minimalistic style that she did, but it's still very powerful. What's being said in the pictures itself. Make beautiful things is for October. November says plant dreams and grow a happy life. I love that. And I ain't not even a plant girl, y'all. I ain't no plant mama. I got three humans, but I ain't no plant mama. I'm a, I'm a fake plant mama. But I'm going to try to get in, get me a real one. My mama got me one for my house. So I'm going to take it. She's been taking care of it right now until I can get situated. <laughs> um, I love this here. So cute. So inspirational. Just the smiles and the, the, the looks and everything, y'all. I just, I love it. I don't know what else to say. So, and that's it. So that's here. And I also give you a notebook page on the end. I wish we had more. If I could find more of these, I would definitely insert it um, and have it. Um, make beautiful things. Love that. And then it says, we're also plan a happy life. And that's the back cover, y'all. So that is the tour, the walkthrough of the Happy Planner line vertical layout 2022 Spoons of Faith by Jane Holiday. So, all right, y'all. Enjoy. Enjoy.